Hello guys, I'm Henry John Griffin, and today I'm going to tell you this is a movie, and in the other movie I had a breakdown over Rogers Parkway, wanting to live in House B. Basically, that's what this movie is about. Now, basically, the you're going to have to sit down and sit back and listen to the story. Alright, the story is... I would like to live in House B because I will be in the green zone all the time and I will be and I will feel I will feel calm and relaxed forever if I were to live in House B. Like if, if I lived in House B, I would be in the green zone longer. And that's what I want to happen. As you can see, I want to live in House B. It is a great place to be. And I can learn so many things by living there. Now. An example of me talk. The reason why I'm talking about this. Is because. I want to go there. And where do you find House B? Well. House B is a place. And you find it at Rogers Parkway. At the school, the Kessler Center. And where is House B located at? House B is located in, in the corner of the school. It is, basically, it is basically far from the building. So that's what happened. So that's what I am thinking about. House B is, is basically in the corner of the school... And it is basically, uh, it is basically far away from the building. So there's an example of what House B is. It is basically something, it is, it is basically a place you find at Rogers Parkway. And it is located in the corner of the school and you find it, you, you find, you find that it's not close to the school, but kind of, because House B also goes to the Kessler Playground. Let me try to get that in vision real quick. I envision what House B is. House B is a place where it's basically, it's basically next to those two houses. It's basically, House B basically sits next to House A. And then, House C is basically the same, kind of the same. It's basically far from the building, but it's in the left. It's in. It's probably in between the building and House C. Is where it's. I think. It, I think it's a place that's for boys and girls to live. Those students can basically live in House B, but most of them can live in House C. I thought of it. I thought of my plan for living in House B. Now, when I like, like I said, I said that I'm going to live in House B, or I want to live in House B. But really, I can't live in House B because. It's, it's, it doesn't have any room for me. They don't have any room for me to live there. And if I lived in House B, then I would be safe already. I would still be safe. And it means I would be safe in those places. The places that I live. House B. House C. House A. Okay? Okay?